Hello, welcome to this channel Gain Java Knowledge and today in this video we are going to learn how to sort a list in Java 8. In this video we are going to see several examples on how to sort a list in Java 8. During a project development every developer comes across a situation where implementation of sorting becomes mandatory. So today in this video we will mainly focus on sorting using Java 8. Okay, let's start to write the code. So here I have created one Java class, Java 8 sorting demo. So in this class first I will declare list of string. So here I have created one list of names having string values. So after that I will just print this list of names without sorting. Without sorting. Okay, let's run this application. So here we can see the output. So as we know insertion order is preserved in list so it is printing the same order in which we have inserted in some list. So if we want to provide sorting order then we need to call names dot sort method and inside sort we need to call comparator dot natural order. After that we will again print list of names. Sorting with natural order method. Sorting with natural order. Okay, let's run this application again and check the output. So here we can see the output without sorting, and here is the sorting with natural order. But if we are using natural order method to provide the sorting then it will first place all the capital letter names after that it will print small case letter names because it is case sensitive. But if we want to provide sorting with in case sensitive then we need to call string class method. So here I will just call names dot sort and here I will call string class case insensitive order so again I will print all the names so it will provide the perfect sorting order because it is case insensitive so it will not check for small or capital case letter it will just provide natural sorting order ok let's run this application again and here we can see the output it will not look for case sensitive it will just provide the sorting order because it is case insensitive so these are the ways that we can sort the string values in Java using Java 8. Like this if we have list of numbers then we can also use same method sort numbers dot sort and we will call natural sorted method of comparator comparator dot natural order and after that we will just print these names. So it will provide the sorting order of numbers. Okay, let's run this application and check the output. So here we can see the sorting order of numbers 2, 2, 5, 8, 10, 30. Okay, next we will see how to sort a object in Java using multiple fields of the object. 
so here i will create one model class employee and inside model class i will declare multiple properties and then i will sort employee object based on the multiple fields so here i have created one employee class and in this employee class i have declared three properties string name int age and double salary and here i have created one constructor so with the help of this constructor i can create the object of employee class and here i have defined setter getter properties and in the last i have declared two string method to print the employee object value now i will go to java 8 sorting demo java class and here i have created list of employees and here i have added three employee object in this list employees list so first i will do the sorting with the help of lambda expression after that we will look with method reference in the last we will check with stream method so here i will do employees dot sort method here we need to call same and here i will declare employee e1 comma employee e2 so here i will use lambda expression and here i will call because we need to provide the sorting of employee object based on name of the employee so first we will do sorting based on employee name so here i will call compare to method with second employee object get name so here i will close now i will just print the names of employees employees dot for each and here i will just print employee object so system dot out dot print talent so here i will just print employee object so here we are just comparing employee object with the name so it will provide sorting of employee object based on the name okay let's run this application so here we can see the output so here first is a after that k and in the last s so this is a sorting based on the names of employee now i will comment these lines of course we did this uh, comparison with lambda expression now i will use method reference to sort all the employees element so here we are the same list of employees sumit karan arjun now i will do sorting based on method reference in java 8 so here i will just call collection dot sort method and inside this sort method i will use employees dot comparator so here we need to call comparator dot comparing method comparator dot comparing and inside comparing method we will call employee get name employee get name that we are using method reference so now i will just print all the employees so here i will just copy this employee dot for each now i will just run this application and so here we can see the output first is arjun second is karan third is sumit so this is the sorting order based on employee names by using method reference in java 8 or here we can also use method reference like system dot out colon print ln function here so we can also print names by using system dot out colon print ln so here we are see the sorting order based on employee names so now if we will provide the sorting to employee object based on name and also based on age then we can just call then comparing 
and here we need to call employee get age so now i will just run this application and see the output so here we can see arjun karan smith we change the value of object so here i will just to copy this name and we'll add one more object with same name arjun but here age will be different 25 okay let's run this application so here we can see first arjun and age 21 this is the sorting order and after that arjun age 25 then karan then sumit so now we are providing the sorting order based on employee name and employee age if the name of both employee are same then it will compare based on employee age there are one more way that we can use to provide sorting in java 8 so we can sort with stream sorted method using java 8 to make sorting easy in java 8 we can use sorted method with that is overloaded method so we can use without parameter or with the help of parameter values so now i will comment this code and here we will see how to sort the list of employee by name and age by using stream api in java 8 so here i will write the code so here first i will create comparator for employee name and employee age so comparator here i will declare employee sort by name and here we need to use e1 comma e2 and here we will use e1 dot get name compare to e2 dot get name like this we can create one more comparator for age so let's create one more comparator and here i will write the comparator sort by age so here we will just call e1 dot get age and here i will call e1 to get age so here we need to use integer class for age so i have declared in private integer age so here now we'll go and here i will declare integer dot compare method integer dot compare method and inside this method i will pass e1 dot get age and need to pass e2 dot get age so here i have created two comparator sort by name and second is sort by age so it will first sort by name after that sort by age so here i will just write employees dot stream of java 8 dot sorted method here i need to call and inside sorted method i will just put the parameter sort by name so first it will sort by name employee object then it will comparing sort by age 
after that we can print all the object using for each loop and here we can just write employee system dot out dot print ln employee okay let's run this application and see the output so here we can see the output first is arjun age 21 after that arjun age 25 and third is karn fourth is sumit so first it will sort the employee object based in based on names if both employee have same name then it will compare based on the age so like this we can use the sorting order based on multiple fields of an java object thanks for watching this video